look where we are. We are on a golf course. Morning everyone, afternoon, depends when you're watching this, I suppose I'm playing in the morning. We are here at Down Milling, one of the Parkland courses that Golf South Ayrshire have available to us. Uh, we're going to be playing a way around the golf. Unfortunately, we've only got the bag nine holes open, so we're going to be playing them twice. Uh, and we'll see how we go on. Um, Let's just play, no challenge today, let's just get a round in. I've not played for a few weeks so I'm absolutely buzzing to be out here. It's a bit cold, a bit wet underfoot. It is January, it's the first round of golf we've played for weeks if not months. So, got the bag, got the trusty bag, we've got our trusty golf course behind us. Let's play some golf. Okay, so we're starting hole number 10, par 4, 329 yards, the flag is kind of dog leg right, you might just be able to see it through those bushes there, <coughs> I think we'll probably just start iron off the tee, see how we go, get the ball down there. So a decent first tee shot, like that. Decent distance as you can see, it's kind of almost a blind shot into the flag. Down there, we're looking at about 130 yards, bit of wind. Okay, so we've played the second shot. We've uh, come up just about pin high um, to the left hand side of the green, so it's going to be a delicate. We want to try and get up and down for par. Let's, uh, let's give it a go. Good pace. Good pace. Should be a bogey, hopefully. Bogey start, never ideal. On to the next. Okay, we're here, the car's gone by here, but we've got a lovely shot of the Dunmillan sign. This is the kind of main road that goes towards the south from here. And now we're playing the 11th, which is the second of the day. We haven't played this one from the kind of the white tee box for some whatever reason. I can't see a yellow one, and it's first time playing this course. So, uh, just shy of 400 yards, par four. We'll go with a four iron again, I think. That was fat. That was a. Uh, that was not good. Nice fat four iron from the tee. Oh, this is a pure bog. Very wet just now. It's, the weather has been absolutely horrendous. Oh, I'm gonna get stuck. My God. Hopefully the ball is actually still playable. My shoes. High flare warproof. This is a. Uh, not pleasant but we'll play the next one see how we go not a great start a bogey and then a chunk off the next tee we'll go again we'll go again i'll find it there we go okay so we've hit that like a grand total of about 60 70 yards at most still can't see the grain just gonna have to play one out there see how we go okay we're moving Okay, another lovely lie. The fairway moved from kind of right to left there, so we missed that again. And we've still got 
175 to the front, so I think we're staring in the face of another bogey here. Not fast, they are pretty slow. We're going to put that down to the, being the first round, but that was an absolutely atrocious hole. A seven. Okay, shambles on the 11th. So we're on to hole 12 now, our third of the day. A uh, 368 yard path forward, we're just going to stick with the four iron, hopefully a better contact on this one. From down there that hill didn't look much, but then you try to walk up it, oh my god, I just need to try and find the ball, but this is Great scenery, I kind of south here. Try and catch my breath. Oh, well, thanks, Hal. Okay, so three minutes, been and gone. Can't find the first one, annoyingly, because it's kind of it's not too bad up here, but it's obviously moved further right than we thought to start with. So we've still got a huge yardage. The green's kind of up and over that way. Yeah. 178 still at the middle of the green and we're now playing third shot from here so let's see how we do. Hmm. Oh it came out but we've got ages to go. So quick update. Of course it's really well. I'm not playing well and hopefully you guys are still hanging about because it's it's quite fun to watch somebody absolutely shank their way around the golf course when it's wet so um three holes in or nearly three holes in look look at it gonna be like six over par not ideal for an 11 and a half handicap but i'm trying to take the positives of which so far there haven't been many but we'll just keep going it's just nice to be back out on the course for a change um swing a golf club properly but that's still another hill cut oh my god no one told me no one told me Dumb Millen was hilly. I moved, I live by the beach now. Oh well. It's on there, that looks okay. How about that? It's not a bad outcome. That's much better. Chance for us saving a bogey here. Well, this green's spongy. Let's see how we do. Absolutely chock full of water. I'm gonna put my hand in that, that's a six. Okay, hole 13, par three, first par three of the day. We're looking at about 100, 140 to the centre, wind slightly off the left. So I've actually hit that. I hit it a little bit thin, teeny tiny bit thin, but not a bad outcome at all. We've got a birdie, but it just gets better the closer we get.
Really frustrating not to make the birdie there, just slid by it the last kind of second. Didn't break as much as we wanted, but never mind. On to the next hole, a par's always good, so we'll take a par considering how poorly it's been going so far. Right, first par five of the day. Down that hill, slight dog leg, can just about make the flag out in the distance. And we're looking at about 456. Wind kind of in two off the left, I think we're probably going to need to take the big dog here. Okay, so coming off the back of a par, we've then gone chunk, chunk, and left ourselves 122 yards in, even after a good drive. So, first shot, let's try and put it on the green. Oh, we do the exact same again. Okay, so after a decent drive, this one's turned into a disaster. We've hit a five. And we've still got that. Aye, okay. but I mean, excellent, good stuff. I love golf. Yeah, I've seen a tee shot and I had a great right at the top, so we are well short. At least I'm going to take it. Fine. Fine, of course. Of course, never played. The ground's horrible. Uh, it is January. The sun's down right in my eyeballs. But I'll tell you what, see, after some good weather, I should be able to close. Okay, next up, maybe short, par four, just just shy of 300 yards. Well, uh, we'll give this one a crack. I think we'll just put the iron in play, hopefully. A bit of danger on the right with the driver we'd end up normally, rather than try to be a hero.
Boat. Cool shot. So okay, so we had a quick look for the window and the trees. Um, typically, <laughs> no luck. So we're playing one over here. This will be our. Oh god, I've lost count already. Fourth shot. Fifth shot. This will be our fifth shot. Brilliant. Here we go. another absolutely wonderful hole we're on the 17th or 8th hole of the day the score is an absolute ball uh, this is a sharp dog leg right to left the, the pin will be over that kind of row of trees there down to the left hand side so I'm at the point where I think I might just want to take the big dog out and sling one the, sc the score's gone <laughs> it's, it's dreadful so let's, uh, let's just try and pipe one and see how far we can get it the close with to the green we can get it but this is what you're paying for when you come and play South Ayrshire Golf Courses. The council will do a great job. I mean, look at that view. Marvellous. Away from the fairway. So just another quick guys, if you've enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe to friends and the golf's not exactly it's not high caliber, is it really? Let's be honest, this is a uh, very much what I expected from my first round back, first time out of golf for a long time where it's actually been in normal golf conditions and not just ice. Busier now, so we'd have to try and jam our way back in to play the, the same nine again. Uh, so I think we'll probably just finish it off with the nine hole, especially maybe the score's gone. I don't know if I've got enough, uh, enough balls in the bag. To be honest, it's been, uh, it's been a mission. But let's see how we finish this time. Finish strong. On the 17th and 18th here, or 18th and 9th. Give us that bug to come back again next time. There we go. We found it. Friday that rolls onto that fairway, no question. 140 yards to the middle of the green, wind slightly right in behind me. Let's see if we can finish this one. Come on.
right, one more to go. Uh, the 18th, part four, just over 400 yards to finish. Wind coming off the left here, it's uh, aye, aye, let's finish this nicely. I know you're like my irons, my irons have let me down today and I, I normally feel like I play quite well with my irons and it's been chunked everywhere, everywhere guys. Anyway, let's play 18. Thanks, get out. Yeah. Yeah. Just the side. Yeah. Could have had that more today. Seven iron. Hundred and seventy eight in the middle. Try not catch this one fat, please. That's better. Be bit right. Ah. And a horrendous score for nine holes. Alright guys, that'll, uh, that'll wrap us up for this video. Um, thank you very much for staying and checking out if you've managed to make it all the way to the end. As always, hit that like and subscribe button. Dalmillan, when the weather has had its way with it, is going to be a brilliant course to play. Um, it's included in the Golf South Ayrshire ticket. Um, if you're looking to play golf down this way regularly this summer, um, obviously we've only played the back nine today, um, we'll definitely get back out when the weather's better and uh, get the full 18 in because this is it's going, to be a, it's going to be a wonderful course when the weather's been warmer and dried it out a bit and the, the greens are running a bit quicker. Um, today's golf, shocking, <laughs> just no other word for it, that 11 and a half handicap is going to struggle this year. Um, I'm not really much more I can say now. I think I was plus 15 or something for nine holes, which is just just atrocious. There's no real excuse. But we had fun. We've played nine holes of golf, fresh air, blue skies. You can't really ask for much more. Thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next video.